What it is, guys, it is your old boy Pilk, and I'm coming at you with more Dokkan Battle. Now, uh, what we are dealing with today is something a little speculatory, I guess you could, for lack of a better way to put it. Um, what we're working on today is we are working on the uh, LR Frieza event, something we haven't worked on in a long time. Now, uh, I've talked about this a little bit, and as you guys know, uh, just before Golden Week, I think it was just before Golden Week, uh, we got the um, uh, the legendary campaign on JP for LR Frieza. Now, I suspect this is probably coming a little sooner to Global, and I'll tell you, number one, why I suspect that. Uh, during 3rd Anniversary, sometime right around 3rd Anniversary, on JP, they got back the Rainbow Bulma that we haven't seen in over a year, uh, as well as Candy Vegino and a couple other things. So, that being the case, it would make a ton of sense for them to do the Legendary Campaign, considering a AGL Frieza is the fourth level, uh, the one you want to farm for dupes, and uh, it gives you a pretty good drop rate on metals as well. So, if we want to run into the LR Frieza event here, there's a couple ways to do this. And it's pretty interesting. Uh, first things first, I'm going to grab this UI Goku friend here. Uh, UI Goku friend is going to give you the ability. Well, actually, more than UI Goku, I would actually grab River Yan. Uh, River Yan would be an even better lead for this because you can run almost an entire Peppy Gals team for this uh, event. Uh, it's pretty crazy the units you could throw on here, especially if you have Rainbow Bulma. But. Um, well, well, I'll show you. UI Goku is also another vi viable option. But uh, I would definitely run a Ribrian lead. Uh, throw on here the units that you could throw on. Um, this is just the Tournament of Power units. I, I could go through a whole team build for it, but it should be pretty obvious what you'd want to get. So you go back in here, see if you can find a Ribrian friend. And the reason that I would push Ribrian for this, Ribrian has a 77% lead. There's no other free-to-play unit you have that can do that. So it's at least not in this capacity, not that you could run on this event. Uh, with Ribrian, your Khalifa should be able to hit for 800 to a million. Uh, Kale, I honestly don't know, but should be pretty close. Uh, my Kale, I did not have enough orbs to rainbow her. But if you guys did farm up Kale and Khalifa from the events that just left, you should be pretty much set to run this. Now... Uh, you will run the, want to run this every single day. This is not something that you're going to want to sleep on. Uh, not every, I'm sorry, not every single day. At least once a week. At least once a week. You will want to run this, and you will want to farm up as many of the medals as you can going into this. Because if you guys remember, when we get the LR campaign, you're going to get a lot of rewards for having this stuff done. So that, just walking in the LR campaign with everything done is going to be a a huge benefit, especially if you can avoid using the Elder Kai's, farm up all your freezes, which is super easy. Actually, I actually have all mine farmed up. Um, so I'm running level three and not level four. Um, farm up all your uh, freezes, have the two SA10s sitting there, one full dupe, one base, and then just take them both up. Uh, if you run it once, twice a week going into this, uh, by the time the event drops, you'll have almost everything done. Almost everything done. All right. Now, follow me. We're going to jump into the event here. Oh, before we do that, there are two major teams you can run here. Um, as of right now, the Peppy Gals team, like I just described, uh, I've done some tests with UA Goku. He's good, but he's not as good. Uh, he's kind of like your, your backup. If you can't do that, most definitely, most definitely the free to play tech team. Free to play tech team is absolutely awesome awesome for this but let's just jump in and uh, i'm gonna use the free to play tech team because that's the one i know i can just get all the time and we'll just bash these real real fast all right all right so jumping into the battle here um the the main boon to this this team are the super saiyan 3 gokus and actually luckily enough we have him right here on the beginning i'm gonna put him at the front and pair him up with kaba uh and he should be doing a good amount of damage in fact he will probably one shot this to be completely frank um, he's just a really, really, really great unit. Uh, mine is Rainbow Starred. Um, there you go. Watch that. Oof, did not one-shot him. Got a, uh, got a, a second attack, but didn't get a super attack off. But either way here, Kaba's going to finish this up. Pretty easy, pretty straightforward. 
There it goes. All right. Moving on. Level two. Uh, what do we have in level two? We should have a Super Saiyan 3 and a LR Goku. There we go. Now, if you don't have a LR Goku, it's no big deal. You can There are plenty of other units you can uh, jump on here, drop on here. Uh, the free-to-play tech team, though, is really fantastic with LR Goku. He hits like a maniac. All right. So, let's feed LR Goku now. And Rainbow Bomb is just going to get whatever she gets. It's not really that imp imperative to give her 12 key. But, let's see what happens here. Almost one shot it. I mean, just a crazy amount of damage here. Elder Goku's going to finish it up. Oh, look at that damage. 736k. People ask me if Elder Goku's worth. Elder Goku is completely worth. And that's with, uh, what, 60% worth of leads? Yeah. Pretty crazy. All right. Level 3 is moving along here very nicely. I like putting my Candy Vegeta at the front. He just. He's just a good tank and a good. Uh, well, I say tank. He's an evader uh, and a good hitter all the way around. Not great, but good. Uh, oof. Not getting the crit. That hurts. That definitely hurts. All right. Kaba's coming in. Four next to nothing. Oof. All right. Here we go. Let's see if we can finish this up. I right, just got to adjust everything here real quick. Make sure we can get our stuff going. Oof. Not getting the super attack for Super Saiyan 3 Goku is going to hurt a little bit. But uh, honestly, hopefully LR Goku will finish it up. He should. He should be doing an amazing job. No double attack. That's the thing. Would have been nice, but it's not going to be a thing. And there we go. He's dealt with. So that's kind of the event, guys. It's really crazy simple. Uh, not very time-consuming at all. Run it once or twice a week. Um, save up as much as you can and set him aside. You will want him. You will want to have this all farmed up before the event drops because then you get everything super early. All right, guys? That's kind of that. A uh, very straightforward question. If you have any questions at all, make sure you comment in the comment section down below. Um, like I said, there's not a whole lot to talk about here. It's just either you run the free-to-play tech team or you run this. Now, the one thing I do want to say, when LR Ginyu Goku comes out, that team is going to blow everything away. But you have to use EZA Gohan as the lead, being that Goku Ginyu LR isn't a drop unit. So... That's the thing, guys. So do keep your eye out for that. After third anniversary, this whole event's going to be a joke. So, again, comment in the comment section down below. Follow my Birdman. Hit me up on Booker. And I will lay your ass out next time.